Hey guys, it's Shamanic and welcome to another video where today we're going to be playing Big Home Stories. This is going to be episode 1. I have played a little, uh, as you can see by my level. I don't know how to check that, I'm sorry. <laughs> um, is it in here? Okay, either way, I'm level like 7 or 8 right now. So basically, this game is Big Home Story. And I'm sorry for the bad graphics, but that's how it's going to be. Because uh, my PC mic isn't working right now. So, sorry about that. Anyway, um, I bought the basis packet package because I didn't, you know, feel the need to have a unicorn pig. So, here's him. Take a Mr. Rock. Um, oh, he actually gave me a rock. That's cool. So, I already have the chicken coop, which you don't start off with. You have to buy it later in the game. Start off with one field, a broken house, pretty much everything broken, except one little field, which starts off like this. Um... So, I'm just gonna hop in, like it's episode 2, so sorry for that you guys missed out on episode 1, but, um, yeah, so, we have to unlock alpaca, alpaca, alpaca delivery. We have to re wait for Rita, wait for a game update to continue here. Well, that sucks. Um, anyway, my chicken really like, okay, so I have to go collect eggs from Jeffy over here, which is my chicken's name. Mm. Weird name, yeah. Thank you for the two eggs. Alright. Then you come over here and talk to this guy with the purple exclamation point, and that's how you know you completed a quest or you have a quest to complete. Or basically anything interactive that involves in the storyline, it'll have a purple exclamation point. Um, there you go. He gave us three small animal fleet, a windmill sticker, and 100 XP. And we're very close to leveling up. Um, so the windmill sticker. We'll basically do this, or no, that's not the windmill, that's the silo. This is the windmill. Um, if you've ever played regular Big Farm, see, here we go, now I can unlock this, boom, now we have the windmill. Um, yeah, so you basically just walk up to it, and here. What can I do with it? Animal feed? You need the stickers, small animal feed. Uh, yeah, so you need stickers in the game to be able to do stuff. Uh, let's feed this chicken here, and wait 30 minutes. Um, this is my house so far. I haven't done anything to it since the first, like, ten minutes of playing. This is basically what it is. Um, it, you, it starts off with boxes and stuff here, but, uh, not too interesting. You can upgrade your house, because here would be the kitchen. Here. Look. Um, this. Yeah, you need 40 logs, which I have nowhere close to that, because, well, I'm poor. And I need more coins, so... Let's go, I believe it's Shepherd's Farm. No, it's it's over here. So Shepherd's Farm is how you get to the woods, I believe. And then Carpenter's House Homestead is how you get to the town. So you come over here. And run down here. Townland. Now this game, again, came out to, uh, yesterday. So there are tons of updates that are going to be made to this game, so be ready for those. Let's get some of these. I need more coins. Let's get this going. This is one of the best ways to make money, just and make other get other items. Just kind of sit here and do whatever you need to do. Uh, what are these potatoes? I'm not sure I have potatoes yet, but yeah. Um, let's see. Got enough cannons to get Mo back. I should bring them to the market. All right, now I gotta go to Mo. Mo is the llama, right here. Very sad and depressed llama. Here. Oh well. Let's talk to her then. Talk to her. Uh. Okay. Bring them to the market. Oh God. <laughs> I'm stuck now. Um. Oh, the upgrade menu. So this is the upgrade. This is what upgrades look like. This area. Um, I need chalk. I don't have enough coins. There we go. And 
Yeah, there you go. And now it's upgraded a little bit. Bit. Sorry. Uh, how my gear? What can I do for you today? About Mo. You cute, my beautiful Mo. Yeah. And now we get a certain amount of XP. We get 25, and we just need a little more to level up. And it's just another mission for us. About the eggs. Palka shampoo. Sorry about the clicking. My mouse is very loud. I'll move it. I'll move it over here. Uh, I guess I have to talk to her again. <laughs> Alright, well, I don't have enough eggs yet. Okay. In here, we'll be eggs. Alright, now I gotta go back to my farm. So you have to go through here and then just go left side. Or over, over here. So this is where you can, you know, this is Amelia's store. So while you're over here, you can buy this type of stuff. This is where you sell. Um, I'm hoping there are other areas in the game where you can do that, but like sell for double and stuff like that. But again, this game just came out two days ago. Yeah. Turn this down, I'm sorry. Um, yeah, this is the same thing. It's just like Amelia's store, except right in your house or in your area. Not as much stuff, you can't buy everything, you can only buy seeds. So uh, I'm gonna. Probably. Can I, do I, need, I need potatoes, so I'm just gonna get. Fuck, four potatoes. No, I'm not gonna waste my money. I, yeah. Yeah, I am gonna waste my money. Uh, here. These logs are pretty useful, so I'm not gonna sell those yet. <coughs> Uh, yeah, so here, I have Mr. Chicken. Uh, looks like you don't have anything for me yet. You still got 25 minutes, but, um, what's that? <coughs> I think you can upgrade your chicken. I'll pet it and stuff and get XP from it. Okay, yeah, level 2. I don't know what a level 2 chicken does compared to a level 1. Uh, it's now worth more when sold. Um,. I'm not sure I want to sell it. Because last I think it was like 300 before to sell it. Or 248 exactly. So, okay, so what is this? This is the cow shed? Big animal barn. Yes, yeah, 20k. I'm pretty poor right now and I don't really know how to get money. <clears throat> That's why I'm making this video to help you guys make money. So, I'd say, because they spawn a lot. Oh, whoa, 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 What you want? Oh, he gives you free stuff. Ha! <laughs> Sorry, I didn't know that. Um, yeah, so basically just kind of go around. You need the digging show. You need the digging badge. Oh, every time you level up, you get to pick from three different badges, uh, usually. And that's how you get those type of badges. And I have a fishing rod as well, fishing badge. So just click on the orange, and you should be good. And later on, just sell the fish. I'd say from the start of the game, the stuff you don't need, like fish and stuff, I'd say sell those right off the bat. Because, um, you know, get more money and get more stuff in the game first. And then you can focus on fishing when it really matters. But since the, the fishing area isn't unlocked in the game yet, because uh, of upgrades, um... Wow, I actually never saw this before. That's cool. Oh, it's like, okay. So I'm looking at a different screen. So yeah, just come over here, just kind of collect everything in your barn. It has a yellow marker around it. Uh, I have too much weed, weed things. Wildflowers. And this is how the farming system works. You just kind of click on it, say done. And things like that. Just, uh, oh, yeah, see? Here, I'll show you. You get three different cards to choose from. I can choose Mining Rocks, which I am going to choose that. Third Field Area, which would be a, a third uh, field area to buy. So this area right here. Or a well, or a second upgrade well, which I don't know what that does yet. I'm just going to choose Mining Rocks and confirm. And then I'm going to press Done on all of these. And then how this works is you click here, you uh, kind of like the normal Big Farm game if you've ever played that. Uh, repeat. It's a little longer to uh, use stuff. Just press start, and boom. Same thing with all the rest of these. Just kind of 
rinse and repeat. And you come over here, start. Click repeat. Click on the plow, repeat, and then start. And that's that's it for the field, really. Uh, yeah, and then you, with water, you come over here with the bucket. It shows you this in the tutorial, so just putting that out there. And then you come over here. Okay. I'm going to do the same thing on these fields. It does take a long time to do all this. For some reason, I don't know why. Start. It takes a little longer than I, I would like to and, you know, enjoy. But I think it's, I think it's just fine, to be honest. And for all you people who are watching this, I know I'm a kid, and I know you may think it's not the best decision to listen to a kid, but I honestly, in my opinion, think I'm pretty good at these games, so I think I should be good for you. So if you like videos like this, just go ahead and subscribe, and uh, for part two, I'm not ending the video yet, I'm just saying that right now. Um, yeah, right here. So it just gives you free wildflower seeds. Well, I don't know where to mine rocks at. I don't know what that does, really. Right, yeah, and then chest. Yeah, so we're going to go to the woods and right here and see what we can do. Alright, well, I think this is logs. And then rocks. Mining straight rocks. See, these are the things you need. For to do this, you just need to click this. You need a certain badge for that, too, I believe. You click orange try to get it on time. It's pretty slow. I don't know if it increases with if you can get a better axe or anything, but again, you'll see that. Uh, you'll see my progress and stuff. I don't want to go over there. Uh, mining rocks. I don't know if that means just mining rocks at the river area or the lake, because this is the lake. Not the river. Definitely not the river. To get those fish, you need the badge, the sticker called Fishing at Lake. Um, where can I mine rocks? Like over here type rocks? Is that just an off area? I'm guessing that's going to be a cave later in the game. Uh, boom. I have my little pig. And that pig is, I'm guessing an online version is going to be shown uh, soon. But since, again, this game only created a few days, uh, yesterday... Uh, it's definitely gonna need a lot more updates to make the game better for a uh, better experience for people. Oh, there we go. This is what it meant. Yikes. And then, uh, what do I get? I get pure rocks from that. And those, I believe, sell for a good amount. So, um, once you get that badge and the mining badge for the logs, you should be pretty set. I mean, when it comes to money wise. You just keep coming back here to the woods, collect everything you can. I will collect this stuff later off camera, but uh, you, you know, mine whatever you can, and uh, just kind of come back to your farm. And um, yeah, let's go here. Let's walk, and we will come over here and um, sell. Uh, it takes, it takes kind of long, it takes long to walk, and then you come over here, and we, look at these, they suffer a lot, and you just kind of do this, boom, you just made $14, and if you want to do this with this, boom, $18, so I'm not going to do that right now, yeah, but this, you know, fish, you don't really need those, right? I don't need those right now, so I'll just kind of sell those, like, um, <clears throat> this is all you can obtain in the game so far, so we have one of these, Wild garlic, stuff like that. And these are the most expensive things in the game to sell. So try getting your way up to that. Um, you can you can get up to those really early. You can get this badge very early. So if you're able to get to here and grow four at a time, you'll be making forty. Uh, you'll uh, if you have what I have right now, you're able to make eighty at a time, depending on how fast it makes. I mean, it doesn't really matter because still you're making eighty at a time. And I mean, who doesn't want to make 80 at a time? I'm gonna, I'm gonna buy four of these real quick. I want to see what I can do. I don't know if I need the badge to do it right now. 
which I'm pretty certain I do, certain. But uh, we can only just test that out. Give me a lot of flowers. And the more I go into the game, the more space I'll have, because I don't have that much space right now. So, yep. Um, come through here and we'll, yeah, I need the planting dandelions next. I just spent 20 bucks for nothing. It takes, I believe, an hour to grow. Does that say eight or one? Um, I'm gonna try to find, not an XP glitch, but a, a, you know, something to get XP really fast. But right now, the way to get XP kind of fast is, uh, just doing these missions over here, doing these tasks, and, uh, you know. I don't know, the windmill works again, I hope you can do something. Yeah, so basically, just, like, come over here, pr click track, it helps a lot, trust me. Uh, it'll, sh it'll do footsteps, as you can see, to exactly where you need to go. And uh, people with the purple exclamation point, click on this, and uh, yeah. And these side quests, this is uh, like side quest is outside the story, so it's just side quests to get more money and stuff. He's gonna give me a bunch of stuff, and I'll be on my little way. And so I'll just okay, let's do doing well, gather small rocks. You can you can find the item in the locations, Shepherd's Farm, and comes let's. New items will be on every in-game day. Some items can only be found at certain times a day. Let's go to this guy's farm and try to find stuff. So I don't think I can find them in my own farm, which kind of sucks. So I'll just have to steal from this guy. See right here, these things. And boom, get those more rocks. Upgrade well capacity. So up to upgrade well capacity, we just go back to my farm. Or your farm, whatever you want to call it. Uh, you come over here, click upgrade, and capacity. Um, I need to get well upgrade number two, which is which to level up. So, um, well, yeah, I think I'm just gonna stop it here. So, if you enjoyed this video and you want a part two. To, uh, you know, I'll probably find out how to do get more XP and more coins faster. If you guys want a part two, then subscribe and like this video and comment what you want to see next, like what you want me to work on next video. Goodbye.